Second down and one for the Wolverines. Knight brings the play in from Lloyd Carr's sideline. Backus matched against Courtney Brown. Michigan's going to have to take a timeout. Which they will do. Time was running down. Rather than take a critical five yard penalty, they'll call timeout. We'll take a break. Decision. I think Michigan probably will have to go for it if it's short, but they're signaling first down. Just enough. Come on, Michigan. Got to get out of the huddle. Come on, Michigan. You got to get out of the huddle and you got to get up to the line of scrimmage and make plays. The most positive Gary Daniels has been about the Wolverines, well, since he turned them down and went to Purdue. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm always just thinking that Bo Schimbeckler would have made you an All America. <laughs> You're right. First down and 10. More confusion from Michigan. Players coming on the field late. That's going to be a penalty. 12 men in the huddle. There's the flag. No time to really take a lot of time in the huddle right now for Michigan. They need two scores. Substitution on the offense. Five Still first down. Right now, if you're Jerry Sandusky, you're thinking, let's run our assignments. He said, if I can be critical of this defensive at all, we've had a little bit of a highlight mentality, and we have not been doing the things we should be doing within the assignments of the call defense. Jerry says, if I call the defense, do what I say, do your assignments, we'll be okay. I remember in each of the last two years, Michigan has whipped Penn State. But here today, the Nittany Lions lead it by 10. First down and 10. Brady steps past Arrington, forced to run. And first down, he got the spot at midfield. Big play, a 15-yard run for Tom Brady. He bails the Wolverines out. First and 15, and, and, and give up that type of a play for Penn State. Still, clock is running. Stop it for the first down, and it'll start up again. Michigan, get in and out of the huddle. Penn State, run your defense. No cheapies right now. Don't give them anything big. Need a quick score. Thomas out as a wide out. Brady. Got an open corral. Another first down. Clock stops at the 31-yard line. David Terrell from Tom Brady, 20 more yards, and the Wolverines driving. And if time permits, stay tuned for the Thrifty Carvinal postgame report. Brent, I, I think if Michigan gets back in this football game, that save timeout by Tom Brady will really come in big at the end of the football game. I think that was a real heady play by a fifth-year senior quarterback. Split backs. Going to go down to the end zone. Incomplete. Macklin coverage too tough. Interference is going to be called on Macklin. It will not be first and goal. 15 yards and an automatic first down. Joe Paterno looking on from that sideline. A slant and go to the outside. Marcus Knight is the guy. Ball's in the air. Just a little bit of his hands on the receiver. Takes it up. I don't even know if it was catchable, to tell you the truth. That was a shaky call. Twelve to go. Michigan in field goal range now. But with first down for the 15, they're thinking get the touchdown first if we can. Terrell will go to the short or right side of the formation. He's limping very badly too, Brent. Thomas, the running back. Brady. Deflected incomplete. Second down. David Terrell has been limping ever since that catch to the sideline. Brady tried to come to him and watch the route is not effective because David cannot really get out and use his wheels. You can see it, he almost stumbled on the play. 
Once the ball is deflected, remember, the defensive back can maintain contact. Thomas stuffed. A beautiful tackle by James Boyd, the free safety, the junior who has made several key tackles on sweeps. Sandusky signals that defense, wants him to hold it right there. They'll be very happy to have Michigan settle for just a field goal, but then can Joe Paterno's offense eat some time off the clock? David Terrell limping worse. You have to assume the pass is going to go to this side because of bad injury to David. Pump fake. Now got a man, Marquise Walker, first down and goal from the two-yard line for the Wolverines. And now they're in territory where the A-train, Anthony Thomas, can run it in. Keith Walker, it's a delay to the outside. This guy's going to go outside, delay, delay, and then cut across as the corner leaves the play. It's called the smash route. Everybody has it. Michigan does it very well. Up quickly. Coleman in that backfield. Here's the toss to the eighth rank. Can he get the angle? Cannot. And Macklin, who committed that costly penalty, comes up from his corner position, smells the play and makes the stop at the five-yard line, second down and goal. Gary, will Michigan now put it back in the air? They have to put it in the air. Because they, they'd like to run the ball, but because of only 3.50 to go in the game, I think they're going to have to throw the ball three times, maybe. Well, two times, and then kick the field goal on fourth down. David Terrell is out of the game. Walker's in the slot. Thomas is out to the right. Shea stays in to block. Nobody's got the tight end. Brady. Corner blitz, middles open, reaches for the touchdown, Michigan, and Brady's legs save the day. On third and 15, he runs 15 yards, then running right up the middle, he extends into the end zone as they leave him uncovered, and it's a five-yard touchdown for Tom Brady, the senior from San Mateo, California. Well, nobody thought Tom Brady was going to hurt this defense, but when you spread out to cover the receivers, Brady, who's doing just like Kevin Thompson, doing whatever he has to do to lead his team into the end zone. And Epstein pulls him to within field goal range. Can Michigan get the ball back in time? Down three, 326 to go. It was Tom Brady with the middle opening up. Watch the extension across the plane for six. Timeout. <laughs> 